Hello guys, so today I want to record this video because I want to continue talking about my condition and show you pictures of my condition. Um, hey, uh, in this picture I'm going to the dentist and my lips don't look that bad. But as you can see, they are, star they are starting to peel. Like I told you before, this condition gets worse if you keep, you know, removing the white thing from your lips. So make sure that you stop doing that. Um, before, I used to take like a towel in the shower and rub it on my lips. Don't do that. Why? Because that's really bad for... Um, your skin especially the skin in, in your lips now uh, this condition comes from an emotional imbalance that you might have so what you have to do is that you have to change the chemicals in your brain you have to basically change them um, there is something off that goes off and the, your body starts, you know, attacking your lips, basically. I don't want to say your body, but your immune system, uh, especially with stress, your immune system gets weak. So, so I, want, I want to show you this book that I'm reading. Uh, it's titled The Depression Cure by Stephen Eller. He got a PhD in psychology. Basically, what he talks about, he talks about a therapeutic life, lifestyle changing program. And that therapeutic lifestyle changing program has six, six things that you need to follow in order for you to get rid of your emotional imbalance and the first thing that he mentioned in this book that i put it here i don't know if you can see it but he mentioned to have a diet rich in omega-3 fatty acids and you can find those omega-3 fatty acids in different food so i'm gonna show you some food over there as you can see this is a diet rich in omega-3 fatty acid it has salmon fish flat seeds eggs different things sardines that you want to eat in addition to that don't you see a trend that your lips seem to get moisturized when you consume things that have oil like this one in this picture now in addition to that he says that you need to engage in physical activity but also to engage in any type of activity engaging activity and by that, he doesn't mean rumination because rumination means that you think a lot about a certain idea in your mind, which most of the time is negative. So he say physical activity, omega-3 fatty acid, and engaging activity. It can be reading. It can be looking at a Netflix series. Now. He also say that you get you need to get some light exposure. And that's something that I don't get in New York because most of the time uh, during the winter, I don't go out a lot, so I stay at home. And during the summer, I'm always doing something. And now this quarantine is horrible. Okay. So basically, he says that you need to get sunlight exposure. And I think I was talking about this with another YouTuber. 
he said that, oh, when I went to Mexico, I um, my lips got better. And I also told him the same thing. Like when I went on vacation, I think, I think it was in Mexico and Florida. When I went on vacation to those places, my lips got better. So guess what? Sunlight exposure is a major issue in this condition. Now, uh, the other thing that he mentions in this book is that you need to have a social support system. And by social support system, um, you know, it can be your friends, it can be your family, whatever makes you happy. Or some people on YouTube, on the um, YouTube community. So the last thing that he say is that you need to have a sleep, at least eight hours of sleep. Now, let me tell you something about this condition that I have been dealing for for I think seven or eight years now. Okay, so the main problem with this condition was that I was taking, you know, I was basically removing the thing off of my lips and I was not fi fixing the major problem which is inside me so what I decided to do is you know start changing my lifestyle my habits so let me tell you something about this condition that I totally forgot because I jumped into another idea but yeah let's talk about sleep for a second a sleep is very important for this condition why because your skin gets um how you call this it goes through a period of re rejuvenation rejuvenation uh i totally forgot how to say that word but i'm gonna put it uh in the video so it goes through a process of renewing itself and your sleep is very important for this condition because I had noticed that when I don't get enough sleep and I go to sleep late and I stress out I wake up with that thing on my lips so guess what you got it take care of your health and don't be sad that you have this condition don't be sad first you need to change your lifestyle and by lifestyle I'm going to try this out and I'm gonna let you know any updates I'm pretty sure that I'm not gonna follow this step by step because I do live in a very a, a stressed out city um i do have a very stressful life lifestyle and i'm trying to change that so quarantine for me was the goat it was the best thing that ever happened quarantine um i don't want to talk about coronavirus but i'm talking about the quarantine the word quarantine where you get stuck inside your house it can be bad and but it can also be good the good part is that you take care of your health your body um in that in that sense like you are doing some self-care for your for you for your mind and your body it can also be bad because your condition of mental health issues can get worse if you're not having that social support system and yeah so this is my video I hope that if you have any question you send me an email or let me know in the comments okay so see you and I hope that you have a great day okay